Here's a look right now with our downtown LA camera looking at the skyline. Lots of blue skies. We barely had any cloud cover this morning, so that's why we're seeing much more sunshine so early on in the day. So temperatures definitely expected to go up by a couple degrees compared to yesterday. Here's what it feels like outside right now. Already in the low 80s for San Bernardino, upper 70s for Fullerton, 73 near the airport, and mid 80s for areas like Lancaster and Palmdale. We are up by a few degrees if you want to compare it to yesterday. For San Bernardino, we're up at least by seven degrees. Five for Ontario, and we still have some lighter winds. That sea breeze continues to push in. No warnings, no advisories. It's going to stay pretty quiet. So we're looking at fair and mild conditions at least through the next few days. Temperature trends. The last few days we have been trending cooler than normal, but at least we're getting closer to where we should be. Our average for downtown LA should be about 84 degrees. So again, you could see all the cloud cover that did actually hold together has cleared away, and a lot of it is just right offshore right now. So again, lots of sunshine, and it's all because of high pressure system coming in from the eastern Pacific, nudging closer to us here in Southern California, bringing us very very stable air. That low pressure system that brought us the cooler temperatures has moved off to the east, but we are eyeballing right now this next low pressure system that's waiting out in the wings. This one potentially could really cool us down as we head into the beginning of next week. So this low pressure system is expected to push that high pressure system out of the way by Sunday, dropping in, and then it's actually going to spin right off the coast after that for the next couple of days, bringing in more of that cooler air and also deepening that marine layer. But I just want to show you the temperature trends. When this happens during that time, we will continue to stay cooler than normal. Our average again normally should be about 84 degrees for downtown LA. So as it moves in on Sunday, we go from 81 to 80, and then by Monday, we could even see those temperatures drop down into the upper 70s. So today, we're looking at highs for the Inland Empire in the mid 90s for. Apple Valley, 91 for Rialto, 94 for Lake Elsinore, mid 80s for Corona, same with Norco, low 80s for the San Gabriel Valley, low 80s for Irvine, and then a little bit more comfortable right along the coast for Orange County, 74 for Huntington Beach, 78 for Long Beach, and for the San Fernando Valley, almost at the low 90s. We're just going to see temperatures possibly hovering in the upper 80s, low 90s, and then upper 70s for Thousand Oaks and Simi Valley, 73 for Oxnard. The next seven days with that high pressure system, sitting over the area, temperatures will get closer to where we should be this time of year, but you'll notice that we're just staying in the low 80s. We're not quite at 84 for LA and Orange County Metro. Our valleys, though, will top out in the low 90s starting tomorrow. So we're going to end the week slightly warmer than what we started off with. And then by Sunday, that low pressure system, as I mentioned, waiting out in the wings, drops closer. So that's going to start cooling us down just a touch. And again, it's going to deepen that marine layer. So we will wake up to gray skies each and every morning after Sunday. Right now, the marine layer is going to get a little bit more shallow because of that high pressure system, and we could even see some drizzle being squeezed out some of the clouds once we head into the beginning of next week. Inland Empire, you will see temperatures today, upper 80s, and then you'll stay in the low 90s from Friday on until the middle of next week. And for the high deserts, you will see upper 90s by tomorrow. You'll also stay in the 90s too the next seven days. And our mountain communities will see temperatures a little closer to 80s as we head into Friday in the upper 70s for both Friday and Saturday, and then slightly cooler on Sunday as that low gets closer to us.